So, I wasn't gonna make a video today, but Cascader was like, hey, we released some new features and we want you to try them. And I was like, all right, sure. What have you guys been cooking? And they were like, okay, you see your character? And I was like, yes, sir. And then they said, okay, make another keyframe and just make it do something. So I did. And then they were like, okay, make another keyframe, but this time move it a little farther away. And I was like, okay. And then they were like, okay, now press the in-between button at the top right. Profit. So like, wait, 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 hold the phone. Did it just guess all the frames in between the keyframes? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so hold on, now you have my attention. What if I increase the distance? Is it gonna compensate for the new distance? Oh my God, it does. Okay, 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 hold on. Well, what if I add a different direction? Holy shit. Animators, the future is here. We are finally getting to that point of just needing to make keyframes. And you can still use the physics AI on top of this to make it even more realistic. Cause look at this, you can literally, man. Okay, okay, regardless, that's all I wanted to show you guys. As usual, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around.